Hello dear Ship Simulator fans, this is Mr. Siliamen speaking. I wanted to show you a little tutorial about how to install new ships into a vehicle simulator. When you have bought the vehicle simulator on Steam, you will find a folder on your computer where the vehicle simulator is installed. And under this folder there is a subfolder called vehicles. The folder in Steam you will find under Steam Apps and Common and then Vehicle Simulator and there's the folder vehicles. There you can put your ships into with drag and drop the ships you can find somewhere on the internet and mostly it's uh, zip folder and you open the zip folder and the ship folder is inside this zip folder and you drag and drop it under vehicles and the instruments and panels subfolder you get out of the vehicles folder and put it into the instruments and panels folder under the vehicle simulator folder then when you copy the ship into the vehicle simulator. Just start the simulation and then load maybe a new scenery. I downloaded some sceneries like Turku Stockholm or Ostsee 3 and when the scenery is loading you have to wait for a moment. Oh, it's dark now, so I have to change the time today so that we can see something. And now I go with M to the map and zoom out because I'm not over the ocean. I'm somehow over land and I have to put myself over the ocean to put a ship into the simulator without having any troubles. So it depends on the scenery, how long it may take to load the scenery. I'm loading a scenery at Helsinki, so there are a lot of objects that the vehicle simulator has to load, so I have a little bit of loading time now. Loading time. Ah, now I'm here somewhere. Helsinki, the Baltic Sea, with the left mouse button by pushing down the left mouse button and moving the mouse up or down, I can zoom in or out. And now I will find me a good place where I put the ship onto the sea. I change the graphics a little bit so I have a little bit more nice atmosphere, a more beautiful sea. So I'm putting on water settings some changes. So they have a nice ocean and now you can push V for vehicle or go under the menu for vehicle and there you see the vehicles you have installed and also the installed from Ilan Papini originally. And there you can scroll down and search for your beloved ship and I would try out the Stena Flavia today that I just copied into the vehicle folder and then you have to press add vehicle and it depends on how huge the model is how long it will take to load but this model goes quite fast to load and there you are there at the bridge of the new installed ship for vehicle simulator by pressing 
the num keys 7913 you can walk through the ship and using the mouse for the direction when you press F2 you can change to the outside view so you can see the ship from the outside and by pressing the num keys 7913 you can go forward backwards left and right in the outside view for the ship and when the model is uh, good programmed you can press P for the panel and put the motor on on this one small gray button and then let the ship roll it may take a moment to see an effect because ships are huge uh, they are not going so fast forward and here you can see the ship is floating through the Baltic Sea and when you press F2 again the camera will stop at its position and you can have a nice look at the ship. By pressing F1 you are getting back to the ship and when you then press the number key 1, 2, 3 or 4 you can change a viewpoint at the ship. shouldn't go too fast otherwise I would may be crash on the island so I'm pressing F2 again so I'm at the outside view and I would like to make the water a little bit more beautiful with reflections so that looks more beautiful what a nice ship And to open the doors you may have to press the G key or the D key or the control and A key together that can open the doors if the model was programmed to have doors So I hope you enjoyed this video and you have fun with this simulator and maybe it's not the best tutorial on the internet it's my first tutorial that I made so please apologize when something is not clear you can write it down into the comments and I will answer your questions. Thanks for watching, have a good time and have a lot of fun with the vehicle simulator. Bye bye!